It's so cute! Hey guys, it's Keegan. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video, we are going to be decorating for fall and doing a little fall decor shopping. You guys know I love decorating in general. I love decorating for the seasons and I don't think it's ever too early to decorate for a season. Honestly, I kind of wanted to decorate for fall like two weeks ago, but I did wait. I asked you guys on Instagram and a lot of you guys said decorate for fall now, but wait to decorate for Halloween, which I can get behind as long as we have some decor. I honestly think, like I said, it's never too early to decorate. If you like something, do it. I think one month is not a long enough time to be able to celebrate a holiday, a season, like Halloween, Christmas. I will be decorating for Christmas, probably November 1st, just throwing that out there. Next video, decorating for Christmas. No, I'm just kidding. But I wanted to take you guys along with me at decorating for fall. I have some fall decor and it's all sitting in these bins outside on my balcony because I didn't know where to put them in my apartment. So I was like, I'm just gonna store them on my balcony. There was a huge storm two days ago, like so big that trees were falling down. So I'm a little worried that all of my decor is soaking wet from that storm. If somehow water got into those bins, we will find out. First up is finding out if my decor is damaged and finding out what decor we do have. Okay, everyone, fingers crossed that the bins are not filled with water. This is them. I have no idea which one's which. Okay, these are disgusting. The top one is Christmas stuff. Okay. These dogs are really cute. Okay, so this is looks like a little bit of everything. I'm assuming this one is the fall stuff then. This is so dirty and it's gonna bring so much dirt into my apartment. One second. <laughs> Okay, let's take a look at this bin. I think that there is a lot of Christmas stuff in here as well. I'm wondering maybe if I just put pillows in here because I have this pillow, which I love. This is from Target last year. This pillow. Okay, I'm seeing some Halloween costumes. Obviously, this is Christmas stuff. Okay, okay, we're getting somewhere. I have some pumpkins. I think this is my little spooky sign. This is burning hot. Oh my gosh. I wonder if anything like melted in here. Oh, I wonder if I put anything in these that could have melted. Because they've been sitting outside in the Arizona heat. I'm trying to see if there's anything else in here. Is all I have in here pumpkins? That's not gonna be good. This is gonna be a very short video of all I have for fall is pumpkins. Let's see, what else do we have? I'm so excited for Christmas. Like I know that I haven't even started decorating for fall or Halloween yet, but I'm already thinking about Christmas. I have some Halloween costumes in here. I'm kind of stressed that this is all I have. You know, I am considering going to Target and seeing what else they have. Ah, there's just pumpkins everywhere. Oh, did that make it in there? Ah. Oh. That wasn't even close. You guys remember when I dressed up as Reputation Taylor Swift? My little rep costume? This is warm. It also smells dusty. <laughs> <coughs> I think it is dusty and I think I just failed it. Of course I would have to Keegan. Like what what was I thinking? Okay, so this seems like it might be all we have right now. This is everything. Ugh, it's not a ton of stuff. I have some more Halloween decorations, but this is what I have for fall. I'm considering going to Target. There's also a few other pieces of decor that I have. This print right here, I have a little fall print behind it that I'm gonna switch it out. And then I got this recently. I got this in one of my weekly vlogs. I also did a TikTok, but I got some florals that are kind of more like fall-esque that I want to switch out with these. So I'm excited for that. But again, we're going to go shopping. I was considering decorating first and then going shopping, but I think that I want to go shopping a little bit for more decor. The good thing about getting fall decor and seasonal decor is that you can use it next year. I don't want to get too much. I don't want to spend too much money on it, but I do have some gift cards. And so that's kind of really where I want to focus on is where I don't have to spend money, where I can just use my gift cards. Because girl math, using a gift card, I'm not spending any money. I'm just spending somebody else's money. Girl map, we are going places with gift cards. I have a home goods gift card that I got a while ago. I need to check to see if that's still in my wallet. Pause. Do I still have it in here? Hello, is it in here? Is it in here? Oh, I found it, yes. Oh, a Jamba Juice gift card? What other gift cards? Panera? Wait. Oh, okay, I have this Target one. I'm gonna put the Target one at the front of the, okay. Oh. Do you guys ever realize like the gift cards that you have in your wallet? Either I have a gift card, I spend it immediately, or it sits in my wallet for years. But we have a Home Goods gift card. So first and foremost, we're gonna go to Home Goods. I feel like Home Goods always has the best seasonal stuff. And then we're gonna stop by Target and then we will see what home decor we find. I know that I really wanna get like some kind of like fall knitted blanket. And then just maybe like a few like little decor pieces, stuff that I can use for fall and for Halloween. Cause I feel like I have a bit of Halloween decor, but I don't have a lot of fall decor. So let's go shopping, let's go use our gift cards. I'm actually so excited about this. I haven't been to Home Goods in a really long time. I don't even know where a Home Goods is. We might be decorating. 
decoration. We might be decorating for fall, but it definitely does not feel like fall. It is still 100 degrees outside. No, it's 93. Right now, we'll be 100 later today. Tomato, tomato. I've always been someone who likes to decorate for the seasons pretty early. Like when I was a kid, it was like the utmost important thing to me that my family was the first ones to have our decorations out for anybody else in our block. I would beg my parents, please can we please, please, please put out the Christmas decor, please. I'm not kidding. They didn't have the same care and passion that I did for it. It might not feel like fall, but it will look like fall. So we're gonna find a home goods. I just typed in whole goods. Yep. Yep. That sounds inappropriate. The closest one is 15 minutes away. That is kind of far, but worth it. We're gonna go. I'm gonna listen to Olivia Rodrigo's new album. I'm so obsessed with it. Quick aquaphor break though. I feel like in home goods, it's kind of like a black hole. Huh? Whole goods. Ah! That sounds like a bird. Do you guys ever use Aquaphor and it like all comes out that all of a sudden you're like, whoa, 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 too much, too soon. Coming on too strong. Love bombing me, but with Aquaphor. So I have no idea what we're gonna get, what we're gonna find in Home Goods. Sometimes they have really good stuff and sometimes they don't. I feel like for me, Home Goods is either a hit or a miss, and I'm hoping for a hit. Fingers crossed. That's the vibe of this video. Fingers crossed everything will work out. Okay, let's play some Olivia Rodrigo. Ooh. Home goods time. I'm so excited for this. This parking lot is also packed, so I'm hoping home goods isn't packed. I obviously don't need this, but this table is really cool. Okay. Oh, wait, that is so cute. Wait, I like this a lot. I also like this. I like immediately walked in. I like this. I like this. I like this. This is not fall decor, but wow, I really like it. I need to focus on what I came here for because I only have a gift card. I don't want to spend a ton of money. I'm not seeing any fall decor yet. We'll find it. I was talking about how I want to throw a blanket and this was exactly what I was envisioning, but it's not very soft, but it's exactly what I was looking for. It's also not very big, but there's a bunch of them over here. Cute. Okay. This one I think is really cute. This is big, which is what I'm needing. I like the look of the other one, but I like the size and like the texture of this one. This one's also cute. This one's also cute. 25. I wonder how much the other one is. I'm gonna throw it in here. Yeah, which is exactly what I want. I also have these ones. I kind of wanted like a maroon one or kind of like this orangey color. Again, the other one I liked more. How much is this one? Okay, it's a $5 difference and this is a lot smaller and not as soft. I think I'm gonna go with the fully orange one. I think that will look really nice on my couch. I don't think I need any throw pillows, but I love the colors. Of this is so soft. I think I see where all the fall stuff is. Oh my, wait, what? Why is Queen Elizabeth on this? Is this a thing? What is this? English tea set? Oh, that's because it's English tea. That makes sense. May she rest in peace. But I think all the fall stuff is back here, which is why I always wonder if the food they have here is... Oh, wait. I can't. I get so distracted. I was going to say, I wonder if the food they have here is good. Oh, they have more blankets. I, I get so distracted here. These are more like Halloween-esque. These are... They're so cute though and soft. I don't think they're going to match the vibe that I'm going for, but they're really cute. Oh, this is such a cute one. Oh, wait, there's a little pumpkin on it. I was going to say, if the pumpkin was only on one side, you could use it for fall and then the other one year round but the pumpkins on both sides but these are all so cute <gasps> that one's adorable oh how much is that do i need it no how much this is like falling out of my hand 13 dollars. it's kind of small but it's really cute i'll come back to it if i keep thinking about it i love a throw pillow there's also some florals but i got some florals a couple weeks ago so i don't need any of those i'm looking for more like decor to put on my table this is the cutest thing i've ever seen in my entire life i love a little ghost how much is this i don't even know what i would do with this they have a bunch of halloween stuff i'm trying to think of other fall stuff that's not just like a pumpkin that i could decorate with but the pumpkins are cute this is cute everything's cute it's literally a pumpkin wonderland in here so cute i don't love anything if i'm being honest though like i like a lot of it but i don't love it okay i guess i could decorate like leaves i do like this i wish i would have seen this before i went to hobby lobby and got some stuff because that would be really cute i wonder if you could take it apart Part, or if it's all like kind of glue. Oh no, it's all glued together. Never mind. This aisle right now is more like a Halloween aisle. Oh, they have fear pong. That's so funny and cute. This is really cute, but this is more Halloween stuff. Oh, look at this. I love all of it. <gasps> That's cute. Oh wait, I'm just connecting the dots. This is like a Ouija board, <laughs> but like in a plate. Look at the little baking. Oh my gosh, I've been wanting a fall candle. Let's do a taste test. This one is from Sand and Fog. It's jack-o'-lantern. That smells so, how much is this? Eight dollars. I might get this, this is so cute. Hey boo. I didn't like that. Ooh, witch's brew. This one's so cute, look at this. I don't like a lot of these. A lot of these are gross. Oh, this one, Haunted Harvest from the same company. It doesn't really smell like much. Stormy Night? It kind of smells like an Abercrombie. We have this one. Oh. I don't, it doesn't smell like fall, but it smells good. Okay, we're gonna do one more. Oh, I think I already smelled this one. Never mind. One different one. This is so cool. Look at this. It has like little hands. It's broken. I didn't break it. I didn't break it. I didn't break it. It wasn't. I think I want to get this one. The first one I smelled. The jack-o'-lantern. 
That smells like fall. Smell it. It's so cute. Okay. Adding it to the cart. They also have really cute dish towels. So cute. I think I do have some at home though. This is so cute. The little pumpkin. Oh, I love that. But I'm gonna walk away from it. I saw this TikTok and it's like girl shopping. And it's like, oh, that's so cute. I love that. And then you walk away. Oh my gosh, this would be so cute in my apartment. Walk away. These are really cute too. Cutie. I wonder if this smells good. Wait, this one looks like it's gonna smell really good. Vanilla pumpkin. My kind of scent. No, it's like a spicy scent, which I didn't expect. There's a bunch of other ones in here that look smell like they smell good. I wonder if this one smells good because it's really cute. Like I like the vibe of it. I still like the first one the most out of all the ones I've done. We really started off with a bang. Oh, sounds like kind of sweeter smelling. If I had a dog, I would so get something like this. This is so cute, but I don't. Okay, these are so cute. Like, look at this. Look at this. Oh, look at this. Look at all of it. Cute is the word of the video. They even have like little soaps, which I think I already have a soap, but it's so cu cute. Like I said, the word of the video, cute. Also, I'm getting so many looks from people in here, like for me vlogging, just like talking to myself, trying to not care. <laughs> I didn't really love any of like the decor, like tabletop decorating decor that I found here. So we're going to go to Target, but I think this is what I'm going to get this blanket and then this candle. And I think this is like a pretty good deal for this candle. Cause like Bath and Body Works candles that are a very similar size are like $20. I'm gonna smell it one more time just to make sure I like it. Yeah, I do. Okay. Okay, it was pretty busy in there. The lady at checkout, she was like, this is abnormally busy for this time of the day. And I was like, yeah, the parking lot was completely full. Now we're gonna go to Target to see what little decor they have. I need to map myself there because this isn't really close to where I live. So I need to see one that's like on the way, hopefully back to my apartment, Target. But yeah, I didn't really get any decor. Oh, okay, perfect. Found one on the way. Soleil, let's do it. Next up is Target. They have some really cute stuff in the dollar section. I guess this isn't called the dollar section anymore, but this area is really cute. Okay, I wonder if this is supposed to be in the dollar section, but this is really cute. Kind of love that. Even for like, not just fall, for like year round. Okay, we have the fall home decor section and I already love everything. It's so, look at the candles. I wonder if this smells good. This one's vanilla pumpkin. This one is acorn trails. What? I picked it up, don't worry. It kind of smells, it's not like my taste in a fall candle. Pumpkin wood. I kind of love these. Like these are so cute, but I feel like they're maybe like a little bland. Like I wish this and this could combine. This is such a pretty candle. Ooh, vanilla pumpkin. I always gravitate towards a vanilla pumpkin. Maybe not. Maybe I don't like vanilla pumpkin as much as I thought. All of these are really cute. And I also love like a wick, a wood wick candle. This doesn't smell like anything. All of this stuff is all really cute too, but I'm like, where? Ooh, ooh, I just hit something. It's so tight in here. But I'm like, where's all the fall stuff? They don't really have a ton. And normally they have a lot. So I'm like, what is going on here? Is it just too early? I hit another thing. But I'm like, is it too early? I don't think it's too early. I was also surprised that Home Goods didn't have out their Christmas stuff. Because I feel like a lot of the times they have out their Christmas stuff like around the same time they have their Halloween stuff out. We're going to go and see if they have like Halloween stuff up like in that back to school section. Yes, I see a ghost. This is exactly what we're looking for. I doubt there's going to be fall decor in here, but let's take a look. Look at how cute these pumpkins are. This one or this one. I like both of them. I think this one I might go with because it has more color in it. $5. It's so cute. It's so cute. I'm also, oh, they have bowling pins with like ghost face on them. Oh, they're mummies. They're not ghosts. My bad. Clearly don't know what I'm talking about. It's so cute. Throwing her. Oh, oh, oh. These are all so adorable. I feel like my mom would like this. I also decided if I'm here, I might as well. And they're on sale. So I got three pumpkins and I think these are all really cute. So I'll kind of like place them throughout my apartment. <laughs> Four technically, my haul. I think it's time to call it a day because I didn't want to get too much stuff, but I wanted to get something. But I'm glad that I have like bigger pumpkins that I got because all I had was like really small ones before. Okay, wait. I think these are real. They're really cool looking. I might want to get one. I don't know if I should. They're $7. I'm kind of drawn to this one right here because it's big. These are all so cool looking. You're sitting in the pumpkins right now. Ow! I hit my finger on the pumpkin. I think I changed my mind. I don't need any of this, but these are so cute. I don't even know what I would do with this, but I love it. I actually love this. This is so cute. Girl shopping, putting it back. None of this stuff is like calling my name. I think it's all cute, but I don't know if it's the vibe that I'm going for. Okay, we got the stuff. I'll do a full haul when I get back, but now I need to find where I parked because I don't remember. I'm thinking somewhere over here. I have no idea where my car is. No clue. I found it. Hello, beautiful. I can't wait. I'm going to eat a Reese's pumpkin. I'm too excited. Yay! Tis the season, you guys. Ah! I'm also sweating. Really hot outside. 
Mmm. Oh god, I forgot how much I love these. Those are delicious. Let's do a haul now that we are back. Also, I forgot to tell you guys, this is so embarrassing. When I was in Home Goods, my phone started playing music randomly. I don't know how it happened, but it was the part of Olivia Rodrigo's song, Teenage Dream, where she's just screaming. So my phone just had like, ah, coming from it. And I was like, overwhelmed. Okay, I'll start with what I got from Target. I got this plaid pumpkin. I think I said this, but the reason I got this one over the other one was because it had more color to it. This is only how much was all this? This was $13 total for all of this. I will admit though, I did eat a couple more Reese's pumpkins on the car ride here. Crown. Why is it that? I just love them. They're, it's hard to limit yourself to only one. I also got this little Sherpa pumpkin. I'm pretty sure my therapist has the same one because she was telling me how she got a pumpkin from Target, like a little Sherpa pumpkin. I, I'm just not connecting the dots. So it's probably the same one or similar one and then i got this one i really liked this color i felt like this material looked very like luxurious and that is my target haul i got three pumpkins but i'm excited because i can also use these during halloween so they can be for fall and for halloween going into home goods the lady was really nice she wrapped the candle so i wouldn't break it because i'm known to break things this is the jack-o-lantern one it smells so good and i like it has this little thing on top i think i already showed you guys all this stuff but just just to re-establish everything that i got and then last but not least i did end up getting the big Oh, 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 the big throw blanket. I think it's so cute. It's so soft too. So I'm very excited. I think we're going to start decorating. I think I want to start with my living room. I think that's like the first area that we're going to start. So let's do it. I'm so excited. I need to like open all this up. Let's untie this and ever wear my scissors. Ah! Everything's falling. Okay, this is the before of my living room. We're going to change out the blanket, the pillows, art, and then we're going to decorate this and this. Let's start. This blanket is not as big as I thought it was going to be. And it, this was much bigger than the other one. So can you imagine how small the initial one that I wanted would have been? Oh, this was gonna be a much bigger blanket. I'm also like a little worried that it's gonna like stain my couch somehow. You know, I don't know. Now we have our little throw pillows. I got these at Target last year. And I think they're so cute. Oh, I love that. And then we're gonna take down the artwork. I'm wondering if this blanket's not the, the right look that I was going for, but we'll see. Okay, let's switch out this artwork. We're gonna start by opening up all of these and I have a bunch of prints behind this art, which is one thing that I really like about this. That's why I decided to hang it instead of using command strip so I could easily take it down and switch out the art to change the seasons or to change my vibe. Before I had like a little meadow and I decided to change it out to be the alcohol prints because I wanted to use that print and I knew I was gonna change this sooner or later for fall. I actually have another print that's for Halloween. I think I've, I've shown that on like TikTok, I think even on here. Okay, wait, what is the one that I wanna do? Not this one, not this one one this one i think i have six prints this is the one for halloween it's like a little ghost isn't it cute how did i do this last time you have to take all of these out ah! it's not as simple as it looks believe it or not okay i'm gonna slide the one that i want in here all of these prints are from etsy i will link them down below for you guys though also this dress has like little shorts under it so i'm not like flashing you i went to the chiropractor this morning and he was like um do you have shorts on under your dress and i was like yeah i do and he was like oh okay good and i was like yeah didn't think that would have been bad oh ah oh. i hope these didn't bend or ruin or anything i don't know really know what i was thinking when i was doing that i was just trying to make it all fit and now wait i'm just gonna double check to make sure i like this yep that's the one and then we are going to close this up and then we will hang her back up. Let's do it. Do we like it? What do we think? What do we think? I think I want to add some pumpkins here. Just kind of tie it all in. Let me show you guys a little up close of the print. It's very similar to like what I had in my last apartment, but like the fall version of it. I think it's cute. And I think that this color ties in really well with it. I feel like it really makes the white couch stand out. Also, I forgot to mention, I changed this out already. I got these from Hobby Lobby. Before I had these in there and I'm going to, I'm going to take those out. But I added this like kind of, it almost looks like dead, <laughs> but I think it's cute. And I think it kind of like ties in this kind of aesthetic. I'm kind of going for like orange or maroon, yellow, kind of just like burnt colors. Is that gonna, that's not gonna chop. Will this chop? No. <laughs> okay, let's take a little look at what we have over here. So we have a bunch of pumpkins. I have these, I don't know if I want to do these pumpkins. I think I might want these pumpkins maybe over here. Let's do something to this. Hi, I'm also filming this for TikTok. If you guys are interested in seeing that, I'm going to kind of do a little transition. I want to take these out and like make it cute for the TikTok. So it looks like I hadn't already had these in there. I think some like cute fall leaves scattered in this would be really cute, but I don't have any of those. So that's that's not happening right now. Now we're adding in the fake, this stuff should a ton. I decided these are the pumpkins that I want to add. So I have an orange one, a brown one, and then kind of like a darker orange one. I think you're just kind of throwing them around. Nah, yeah, that doesn't, that does not look good. No, 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 no. Yep, that's not it. That's not the one. <laughs> what if I do like a little pumpkin here? And then 
Okay, we're getting somewhere. I'm also gonna throw in that candle. You know, I'm not obsessed, but I don't hate it. Next up, I wanna decorate this. I think that will kinda help tie it all in together. And then I might add some more pumpkins in here later on if I have some left over. But I think that the first thing that I need to do is change out this greenery that I have. And so, like I said, wait, I'm gonna take all the greenery that I'm using now and just put it in here. Like I said, I have this greenery. So I think that I need to trim it all to be the right size. That was so loud. That was also, what? You think I would learn my lesson? <laughs> there we go. So this is all the greenery that I have. Can you see me? Hi. This is all the greenery that I have. I'm going to trade them out with some more kind of like fall, more like dead looking greenery. So this is what I have. This one right here. So these are kind of like more like burgundy, maroon-ish, maroon Taylor Swift, haha. Then I have these that are like more like yellow pom-poms. And then I have these, they almost look like candy corn. Take these out. This one's gonna go by my TV. This one's gonna go on my kitchen island. This one's gonna go on that shelf. So I'm trying to think which one do I want for which? We can fluff these all out and kind of make them, make them bigger, you know? Make them fluffier, make them more filling. And then we're gonna have to cut them to size so they'll fit in the, what is this thing called? Like a planter, a potter, a Harry Potter. I think I want it to be maybe that tall. So I'm gonna just try to snap it. Oh, I can bend it. That That's probably a better option so I can reuse them. I have no idea what I'm doing, if I'm being honest with you guys. I'm kind of just winging it. I don't think I've ever done this before. We are finding out what to do together. We lost a feather or a leaf. Salute to the fallen soldier. Is this too tall? Is this too tall? I don't know if I got enough of these. I thought I had way too many of these. I was like, oh, this is plenty. Maybe not. But we're going to fluff. And we're going to hope that fluffing fluffing does its job. We're basically trying to fluff it like a Christmas tree. This is making it look worse. Trust the process. We're trying to trust the process. I wish I would have gotten one more. But I, I remember I had one more in my cart and I was like, that's that's way too many. I don't need that many. Maybe I did. Ah, they're all stuck together. That doesn't look good. From far away, it looks fine. Up close, not so much. Let's go with this little guy. This little guy has the cute pom-poms. Now I'm wondering if these are also... So not enough. I think these ones are so cute. Switch focuses and oh, we're gonna try this guy. This one is from my kitchen island. Stickers are really on here, man. Oh my gosh. Who did this? Oh, I have three of these. Okay, this one I have. I have quantity. Snip, 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 snap, zippity doo dap. I don't know if I love this greenery that I chose for this because it looks kind of cheap, but it was cheap, you know? It kind of just looks like, like a bad hair day. I'm wondering if I add in these, if this will look better. I don't know if that made it look worse or better. I have no idea if I'm being honest. Eh. I think it just looks like a lot of brown stem. Well, no, I think it makes it look fuller. What do we think about this? Do we like it? Do we hate it? Next up, we are decorating my TV console. First things first, we're gonna add this. I almost dropped it. Big. Next to it, I'm gonna add the little plaid pumpkin that we got from Target. I think it has some nice like maroon colors to kind of tie into it. Do we like that? I also have this that was initially over there. Do I keep that over here? I'm debating if I want to add any of these little pumpkins. No. No, we're gonna add those to the other side. This side doesn't look super fall because the green, I feel like the green is not a super fall color, but we're gonna add in some pumpkins. Let's add in this one. I have these little ones. All these are from Target as well. Should we do another one? What do we think? I have these two little cups. I don't know if I love those there though, if I'm being honest. They kind of look out of place. Like the scaling of it, they're too small. Like there either needs to be more or they need to be wider. Okay, next up we are going to add some pumpkins to these shelves, just the bare minimum, but hopefully it'll make it more fall. The hard part is deciding where I want each pumpkin to go. I think I'm just gonna start placing them and kind of move them around. I'm starting out with the bigger pumpkins. What if I like put them like on? Is that weird? No, that's totally weird. Oh, that's cute. I'll show you guys them up close. These pumpkins are really cute. I like putting them on the books. I think that's cute. I like I need one kind of at the bottom. Oh, I like the brown one though. I think the brown one, I'm gonna put the brown one here. Okay, I'm switching these out. <laughs> I kind of want the boring ones to be at the bottom. Like, I'm gonna put those down there, you know? I have two more of these cutie little ones that I can add. Let's do this one here. That's cute. And then we'll do this one. Is that cute? Yeah, yeah. I got these pumpkins from Target like years ago, but they're so cute because they have these little colors woven into them. Some do, some don't. This boring one that I put down here, that one doesn't. This one does a little bit. This one I think is so cute with like the pink. And then these are the other ones. So there's little pumpkins on all of them except for this one. And then I think that one. Oh, and that one. Yeah, they're cute. Pumpkins everywhere. Pumpkin galore. Last thing we're going to decorate this little wooden block that I have on my kitchen island. Okay, so this is what we have here. Normally I have the greenery there, obviously and then this knot, this little ferris wheel, and then these I got from Greece. We're gonna switch them out with pumpkins. These are the two pumpkins I got from Target. Okay, let's start off with this. I'm gonna kind of fluff these out a little bit, you know. I'm trying to make it look good from both angles, so I have one of the pom-poms in the front and then one in the back. Oh okay, yeah, that's cute. That's all right, we're gonna take out the knot and we're gonna add in a pumpkin. It reminds me of that TikTok. <laughs> it's like Palo took this and this and made 
a princess. I'm also gonna take this out, and then this out, and then add our little baby Sherpa pumpkin. Pumpkin galore. I don't know if that pumpkin's maybe too big for it. Hmm. Wait. Pause. I'm gonna steal a pumpkin from over here. Maybe we'll trade those out. Let's try this one. Is that a better size? I think it's a better size, right? Or, mm, I don't know, maybe it's too small. What size do we like better? No, I think I liked the Sherpa initially. Okay, cute. We're just gonna bring this guy back to his original spot. So cute. And then I still do have those two little cup looking things. We'll just add them over here. Also, I have this cute little dish towel. How cute. What do we think about this? So orange and then white. Yeah. Cute. Okay, I think it's complete. Let me show you guys how it all turned out. On the kitchen island, we have this. Okay, I need to put this away. I'm gonna put all of the decor that I'm not using anymore in here and then put that on my balcony. So I'll do that in a minute. <laughs> but I have this. I think this turned out pretty well. I think that the variety of the florals make it look nice. We have the Sherpa pumpkin. I'll link all the stuff that I got from Target down below for you guys. We have this. I honestly just shoved all that decor over here, which I'm probably going to put it in that bin. But we have those. I think I've had these since I was in elementary school. Like I think I took these from my parents' house. Here is is the shelves. I think this looks really nice. I also had one extra pumpkin, so I put it there, but nice little pumpkins everywhere. I think they're cute. They add a little bit. I wish I had like some fall leaves. I think that would be cute. Like I said, I also think some fake fall leaves would look cute like under here, but I think the living room looks really nice. I didn't decorate my bedroom or my bathroom because I didn't want to just spend the money, honestly, to buy more stuff for that, but I think the blanket is really nice. I really like the color of this. I kind of wish I would have gotten a print that maybe was a little bit more colorful and not so brown. I don't know if that's the right word for it. I wish I kind of had one that had more color picked up in these but I think this looks better than if I had what I had before I think this is super cute I'm so excited to light this candle but I think the first time you light a candle it's always so important to get to the edges and I don't know if I'm gonna be home all day so one day probably on a Sunday when I'm cleaning I will light that and it'll be a nice little reward some pumpkins I think this is super cute I think this right here is just like my favorite part of it all and then I love this one of my friends gave me this in college which was so nice of her and then we have some little pumpkins here and that is it I hope you guys like this video if you guys like decorating and shopping for some fall decor with me. I'm so excited to decorate for Halloween and I'm so excited to decorate for Christmas. I love you guys and I'll see you in my next video. Bye! Mwah.